Did you enjoy the warmer temperatures and peaks of sunshine that we experienced yesterday and want to know if more is in the store? Are you headed out this weekend with travel plans for the Easter holiday and want to know if the weather is going to affect your plans? Well, that's all in store because the Campus Weather Service video for today, March 27th, 2013, starts right now. And good morning and welcome to your Campus Weather Service forecast for this a Wednesday morning. I'm student meteorologist Ryan Bells. How about that weather we had yesterday? Slightly warmer temperatures, still a little bit below average, but it was pretty nice out there to see some peaks of sunshine, which is unnormal that we've been experiencing over the last few days. It's been quite cloudy, but yesterday we finally did see some peaks of sunshine. We're going to turn it over to the weather wall right now and see if our student meteorologist Amanda Hendricks has any sunshine and even warmer temperatures in store. Do we, Amanda? Yes, Ryan, we do. As you can see in our weather headlines, we have uh, some isolated rain and snow showers today, but the sun should uh, come out tomorrow, but we still have a chance of a few flurries. And then looking into the weekend, it looks like sunny skies with much milder temperatures looking ahead to Easter Sunday. Now here's a live look from the Walker Building at the Penn State campus. Our current conditions right now are about 32 degrees, but it only feels like 22, and that's due to the west wind of about 15 miles an hour. Now looking at our weather almanac, you can see that we are much below our average. The high today is only to reach about 42 degrees, while the average high for this time of the year should be about 52. The temperatures tonight are pretty seasonable as we're only about 2 degrees below the average. Now here's a look at the temperatures across the state. You can see we're pretty much in the 30s uh, for the majority of the state. We have about 32 degrees in Clearfield, 37 in Huntington, and we're at about 37 in Sealands Grove as well. Now panning out as a, for a wider view of the state, you can see that we're almost at 40 in Philadelphia and Harrisburg, but we're at about 32 degrees in State College and even chillier as we reach up into the northwest part of the state in Bradford. Now here's a look at the national temperatures. You can see that it's pretty chilly across the nation. We're only at 43 degrees in Tampa, so it's pretty chilly for those folks there right now. Now you can see that we're about 32 in Tulsa, 42 in Portland, and a chilly 11 degrees up in Bismarck. Now here's a look at the radar. As you can see, as, uh, till about 7 o'clock tonight, we have a chance of flurries, across, uh, flurries and rain showers across the state with relatively cloudy conditions. Now looking into tomorrow morning at about 9 o'clock, you can see that we have pretty cloudy conditions across the state, uh, but those clouds are going to continue to dissipate as we reach into Friday and into the weekend, and you can see a general clearing for the majority of the state with really no big chance of precipitation. Now here's a look at our forecast for today. You can see that we're going to have temperatures of about 42 degrees with rain and snow showers, but otherwise mostly cloudy conditions. And it's going to be a little blustery out there with winds for between 9 and 15 miles an hour. And a look ahead to tonight, we can continue to see a chance for snow showers with low temperatures dropping to about 32 degrees and those winds from the west continuing. Now a look ahead to tomorrow. Looks like it's going to be a mostly cloudy day, but there is a chance for a few peaks of sunshine. Highs will reach about 40 degrees. And now a look ahead to your Easter. Uh, we're going to see mostly sunny skies and a high about 53 degrees. Now that's much higher than we've seen pretty much all of uh, the spring that we've had for the past week. So it should be a good day in store. And now here's a look at your seven day forecast. For today, Wednesday, looks like rain and snow showers uh, throughout the day with um, a chance for a few peaks of sun. Lows tonight will drop to about 30 degrees. And for tomorrow, looks like mostly sunny skies with lows at about 40 degrees. And finally, for Friday and looking into the weekend, you can see a general clearing as we have uh, sunny skies, but temperatures continue to be on the rise between 43, 49, and 53 degrees looking this ahead to Sunday. And now as we look into the beginning part of next week, we have another system that could possibly move in Monday, bringing some cloudy skies, but temperatures are still going to be mild. And then by Tuesday, we have a chance of partly cloudy skies, but uh, temperatures are going to be back down into the low 40s. And now, back to Ryan.
Thanks, Amanda. That's all from the Campus Weather Service. But before we leave you today, we want to just remind all Penn State students here attending University Park campus that today is election day for the University Park Undergraduate Association, your student government here on campus. So we want to remind you to go, go and check out vote.psu.edu, where you can see all the candidates' biographies and their platforms. And while you're there, you can cast your ballot. It's easy as that. It only takes about five minutes. So for all of us here at the Campus Weather Service, we'd like to wish you a happy Easter weekend and have a great day.